You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have one of my favorite guests for Greater Brockton. I have T.D. Neguet. Hey, Tee Dee, it's welcome. good nice to, to see you. you Happy summer. Happy summer. It's officially <laughs> summer now, and yes. uh, it, uh, the roller coaster weather we've had all spring, where it was summer and it was winter and it was spring <laughs> all in the same season. It's good to be it's finally made past its mind that point. up. Yes. yes. And uh, mm -hmm. where else would there be great stuff? do during the summer but full of crap. Yes, yes indeed and what a great time. On July 1st we have a special invitation to all Brocken residents. Mm -hmm. We're offering free admission from July 1st on forever. To infinity. Yes. Okay. To the museum. That means during all museum hours if you come and present your ID as a Brocken resident you can come and enjoy all the exhibitions of museum at any time. That's amazing. <laughs> I, 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 and so why are you doing that? It's, it's been a, the Fuller Craft is a, has membership, yes. but they have guests. Okay? Yes. And in the past, the only time a guest could go is if they came with a member or if they came on Thursdays. Yes. There's a, it's, it's so the why did you do this? Why is this a, a, a new happening thing? It's a special initiative to really invite more of the Brockton community into the museum and to make them feel that the museum is their museum mm -hmm. and to also in extend you know arts access to everyone so so it's a big deal there are a lot of Brockton residents who have never been to the museum mm -hmm. and we want to change that so well that's the yeah. way to do it free is good yep okay <laughs> so increase the <laughs> access to the community yep. I mean we do have folks in Brockton that a couple mm -hmm. of extra bucks would be a lot and a stretch to go and pay yeah especially if it's a single mother and a couple of kids or a single father yep. and a couple of kids yeah you can get passes or you can get in on a special day but this is every day mm -hmm. this is I think it's way cool well we're How's excited that? about it we're okay. hoping that Tons of Brocktonians will come and you know and and check out the museum. Well, it's a beautiful you know? space. It's in. So. It's right at the edge of Fields Park and the jewel of the city, the crown jewel of the city. Yes. Um, yes. It's in a easy to get to a location. Mm -hmm. You have parking. Yes. You even have overflow. I know the church is a good neighbor. Yes. And they let you use it when Free you're not doing church it's, services. It's, but it's, like yeah. in Boston, you go to the MFA, you get your tickets and you get your parking. Yeah. Oh. And your parking. Might be more than the tickets. Exactly. You're talking okay. maybe 20, 30 yeah. bucks so and upwards. <laughs> I think this is so. great because it's such a nice space. I've noticed recently, I've seen a few postings on Facebook with so mm -hmm. people having events there. Yes. You have a function room that's available for rent. I, yes. I've gone to more than one or two weddings there where people have done weddings. I've gone to mm -hmm. sad occasions like... Uh, you know, uh, like collations after someone passed uh, away and they yep. did a celebration of life like Judge Mathers was mm -hmm. recently there. Yes. Um, Jack Units, when he was mayor, used the Fuller quite a bit. There oh, really? A lot really? of events that happened at the Fuller. The okay. NAACP has used the Fuller. Yes. It, it's, there aren't a lot of venues in Brockton and you have a nice room and yeah. you have a kitchen. And there's a kitchen there as well, so uh, definitely we do. That's not we, free. That's not free. We do rentals, and you definitely want to talk to our rentals coordinator, Gwen Gavin. Okay. Um, you can call the front desk and ask for her. Uh, but it is a beautiful place to have events, and you know, if you're looking for that wonderful combination of nature and art and just a nice space, mm -hmm. um, that's definitely you definitely want to give us a call. And the nice thing about it is, it's nice inside and it's nice outside. You guys have had yeah. exhibits outside. Yeah. Um, it fits right into the uh, to nature itself with yeah. the way the park is. The the the. The pond is there. Yes. The towers across the way. Yes. People walk all it. It's calming. It in is. The, in, a, in, in a city. Yes. Oh, yes. It's like a retreat. Mm -hmm. It's like you escape to some other place where you can go and enjoy art, see things you've never seen before. Mm -hmm. And then also you feel you're, you're a part of nature, too. There's a whole natural experience of being on that plot of land. And then you can also make it part of your trip to D.W. Field Park. Right. You know, let's say you're going to take a walk, you know, or maybe you start that walk at Fuller Craft and make a loop, you know, or, or, you know, see some art, be inspired, go into the park, be more inspired, write some poetry, you know, talk, talk to your kids about what they just saw. It can be really enjoyable. And besides exhibits, there are all sorts of other things going on there. Yes. Okay, when you talk about media, people, like, think radio, television, 
newspapers. Yes. That's not media. There's, there's media. <laughs> yeah. There's there's clay. There's, there's pottery, clay. There's yes. There's painting, wood. There's wood. There's Ex glass. Exactly. Um, exactly. There's also something like we're going to talk about some of the programs, but there's chess. Yes, there is. So tell yes. us about you doing a chess class. Yes, we have chess classes on July 15th and 16th for adults and kids. So if you are a beginner or if you've never played chess before, you can come down between 10 and 2 and you know, register for classes. It's going to be it's going to be fun. You can learn how to play chess. It's a fun game. So now I also heard you say before we started recording yes. something called Summer Spark and there's two yes. different Summer Sparks. Yes, there are two different ones. There's Summer Spark and Summer Spark Teen and they're organized by our education department. They are a series of uh, one-week workshops starting from July 11th through August 11th and they're perfect for your kids. You know, um, each week features a different medium. Mm -hmm. You know, there may be painting, there may be pottery, there may be fiber work, but you can bring your adolescents or your teens, you can uh, register in either Summer Spark or Summer Spark Teen for a week of, of workshops uh, around that particular medium and just really engage them and they learn a lot during the summer. So Nominal cost for that, right? Yes, it's very, it's very affordable. Okay. Um, and you, you should go on www.fullercraft.org to actually see the pricing, but register today. They're filling up. So. It is, I'm sure it is filling up. Yes. And uh, I, believe it or not, we already got the th three minute queue, it's probably two. Oh, okay. We have a performance, we have, we have drama. Too. Yes, we have theater, kids okay. theater actually. It's a, a performance called A Little Princess and it's going on from July 21st through July 23rd from seven to nine. Uh, there is a small entry fee, but it's very affordable for adults and for kids. So come bring the family to, to see this wonderful play. It should be a lot of fun. So every night, 21st to the 23rd, Sounds, Seven to nine. Sounds like a plan. Now give us the general hours of the museum because now if it's open all the time and it's free, what are the hours? Exactly. So Tuesdays through Sundays, um, we're open from 10 to 5. Mm -hmm. And on Thursday evenings, we're open from 5 to 9. Okay. So we're closed Mondays, but every, the rest of the week, basically open from 10 to 5. And you can come see some beautiful, we have some excellent exhibitions now too. We have uh, um, quilts, we have a wonderful glass exhibition that's opening this Saturday, if you're okay. around, come to the reception. Okay. Amber Cowan, mm -hmm. <laughs> and okay. uh, she's speaking at 3 p.m. Uh, but so we have a wonderful selection, and and uh, really now's the time to come and visit. Last but not least, phone number. Some people aren't web literate, so just real quick. 508-588-6000. And some friendly person will answer the phone. Exactly. So TD, mm -hmm. wonderful news. I think that's great for the community, Brock, mm -hmm. and I think more people should take advantage of it. Always did. Yep. But if you want a little more than that, you can also be a member. So we'll we'll yes. we'll, we'll we'll do another one on membership. And yes, what we the should. Benefits of membership. Definitely, okay? definitely. Thank you. Thank Pleasure you for to have having you, me. As always. Pleasure. You are watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the city of Champions.